SVG's Jason Dackman here with Altitude and KSE's Kenny Miller. Ken, uh, you've been with Altitude now for going on six months, roughly, coming over from the Root Sports uh, landscape. How have the first six months gone, and how did the conclusion to the Nuggets and Avalanche season go this year for Altitude? Well, it, it's actually been very educational for me. Um, coming from the Fox world before with 22 regions, then the Root Sports world, DirecTV, AT&T, of uh, four regional sports networks, they were different than Fox, and now coming on to a team-owned uh, network uh, really has been, uh, it's been interesting because now I'm looking at the world totally different. I'm looking at it from, you know, what is Nesson doing, what is Time Warner doing, all these uh, single-owned uh, uh, and operated uh, regional sports networks. Right. So it, it's been uh, it's been great though, and being team owned, your mentality is different too. That you know the the same owner of the teams is the owner of the network. Right, right. So with that O and O in mind, from the digital side, how can Altitude, uh, the Nuggets, uh, the Avalanche, how can everyone work together to create common digital uh, content? Um, and thereby serve also the, the linear portion of it while serving all those various digital platforms and social as well. Well, you know what, we, we always talk about access. So you would think going to a team-owned network, you'd have all the access in the world. Right. So, but you're dealing with teams, you're dealing with coaches, you're dealing with general managers, and they don't quite look, you know, uh, think about it that way. Mm -hmm. So when you look at what is, uh, you know, what you can do digitally along with the linear channel, you need that access for one, so that's one of the first things uh, coming over to Altitude is gaining those relationships with the teams and, hey, we're all one. Right. We're, you know, this is your network, you know, the old Jerry Maguire, help us to help you, you know. Uh, so in saying that, um, really their digital platforms, Altitude TV digital platform, we all should be in sync. Mm -hmm. And to be able to not only look at it as, oh, they can take content we're producing for the linear channel. How about we start producing that content for the digital, uh, for the digital world too? So if we're doing, you know, if we're doing an interview with players or a feature with players, well, let's just do some two minute original content right. for the digital side. So, and drive people on our linear channel, drive people to the digital side, and digital side, hey, here's what's coming up tonight during the broadcast. Right. So that's that's a that's a huge goal. Potentially even using tools like Facebook Live for maybe some behind the scenes things, stuff that's outside the usual rights uh, and traditional window, uh, telecast window, to maybe get some live content in there, right? Yeah, you know what, I was uh, one of my first, uh, when I got over to Altitude, I went on uh, my first avalanche trip. It was uh, through, um, three Canadian cities but sitting there at skate and with all the talent it's like wow you can you know take take your phone and all of a sudden let's see what we can do right. by broadcasting uh, on Facebook live on Periscope or, or whatever the platform you know can we build a following on that and also hey do you want to know what's going on at skate do you want to know what's coming up on our network tonight during the game it, it really sitting in your office or, or whatever you don't oh yeah it's skate I'm gonna see what's going on so who knows where that's going but it's it's really intriguing sure and going behind the scenes helps uh, fans identify and give a little bit more of an identity to players Nuggets and Avalanche both teams somewhat in transition right now um, a, a lot of the marketing has always been about uh, you know the legacy of both those teams right. especially with the Avalanche Joe Sackick Peter Forsberg Patrick Waugh how can you go about establishing these personalities currently on the team as a brand so that fans want to engage with these guys and watch the game you know regardless of maybe if they're a, a title team or not well you know when you look at all our regional sports networks we have a lot of unsold inventory um, minute 30 two minute break you know that we fill with promos and well how about doing how about we doing more player profiles um, playing them in those you know minute 30 let's get to know the players right. but but also um, if you if you look at altitude and what we we've had on the air are these uh, moments in time but they're all the old you know the like you said the Peter Forsbergs and Joe Sackett they're, they're those moments and we really need to identi identify our fans with our players of today 
So as soon as Matt Duchesne scores a goal, let's get that on the air tomorrow as that's our flashback right. and, and really, you know, really get to know these players. And, of course, some of the other things we talked about um, with some of the networks doing the, the, the um, hard knocks type of shows. Mm -hmm. Behind the so scenes. Behind all the access. scenes, all access. Uh, you know, if you get to know these players off the ice, um, you're going to fall in love with them. Sure. You know, and you follow, you don't you don't know you're, you're going to connect, and that's what you want to do is connect our viewers with our players. So, it, win or lose, uh, they're going to have an identity with those players and want to watch. Cool, Kenny, we appreciate it. Thank you so much, Thank and uh, we'll stay tuned to see what Altitude has uh, the coming rest of the summer and for the Nuggets and the Avalanche season. In the meantime, stay tuned to SportsVideo.org and our on-demand page for more SVG on-demand content.